Hello everybody and welcome to the Q&A episode 3. Now this is actually going to be a bit short for a Q&A video, a bit shorter than normal, and that's just because there were 5 questions that were asked this time and last time there were a lot more. Uh, I'm totally fine with that. If you have any more questions for me, put them in the comment section down below this video and I will get to making another Q&A video as soon as I have a good amount of questions. That way I don't make an announcement and then have to just kind of go with whatever I get. I can accumulate them over time, so that's what I'll be doing in the future, but let's get right into it. So, Gav R3 or Gavin asks can you display your favorite meme and imitate it as best as possible? Now, if you remember the last video, I think it was the last one, maybe it was the one before that, um, I answered this identical question and it was, one does not simply, and it was the whole like, one does not simply walk into Mordor. And then I made up a really, really crappy one, which was, one does not simply stop playing Farming Simulator, and while that holds true for me, I have a feeling that it's only me, so <laughs> we're gonna move on past that. Now, recently, um, I guess in the past uh, half of a year, I think, uh, I have become incredibly addicted to memes. So to say that I have a single favorite would be like um, choosing your favorite video game, which we'll get onto later. Um, however, one of my very favorite memes, and I'm not going to demonstrate this one because it's pretty hard to, to demonstrate, but it's just a picture um, of Captain Jack Sparrow from Pirates of the Caribbean holding a, uh, you know, his compass that guides him towards what he wants. Spoiler alert! And the text on it is, autocorrect changed morning run to morning rum. Change of plans, boys! <laughs> and it was, it's so beautiful! And I love it so much and there's so many so many memes out there that it's really hard I know that there's the the basic uh, formula ones one of my very favorite memes is we are number one I get a kick out of it every time I swear I've watched probably 90% of the ones that are out there just all in a row I binged them as they came out and it was oh boy I mean I even um, got onto the bandwagon a little bit I love the dank meme compilations. Those are some of my favorite memes. Just very, very good. Perfect, perfect memes. It's the weirdest kind of art uh, where these people can take this totally normal video and add some distortion, some weird camera effects. It's beautiful, and those are some of my favorite memes. I could go on for forever, but those are the kind of the core of my favorite memes and type of memes. It's, it's just beautiful. Memes are life. Your favorite meme can be your favorite meme for a week and then you no longer like it and that's that's what I'm going through. My heart is, is torn because every single time I start loving a meme, it just, it starts getting repeated so much that you start losing interest in it, like D's nuts and rage faces and stuff. Those were really funny years ago, and now every time you see one, it just it's kind of a cringe. So very, very hard to uh, keep the meme community happy because it's very easy to get bored because if you keep following the same formula, no, nobody likes your memes anymore. Speaking of dead memes, Vlekerson asks, what is 9 plus 10? And the answer is obviously 21 and I have nothing else to say about that. <laughs> Vlekerson says, act out the whole movie Jaws in 20 seconds. Now, don't be shocked, but I personally have not yet seen the movie Jaws. However, I have a pretty good idea of how it goes, so so let me know. Let me know how I do. Dun, 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 100% perfectly movie accurate. You don't even need to tell me how good I did. It was absolutely perfect. Betting4811 asks, what is your favorite game? Oh my gosh, is that a complicated question. Uh, if we went by game I played the absolute most right now, it would either be 
uh, Farming Simulator or Elite Dangerous, and uh, <laughs> I play a lot of them. A uh, uh, close, maybe third, would be uh, Kerbal Space Program and Halo 5. It's just, it's that little group. I played a lot of Forza Horizon 3 recently, but it was kind of when the uh, Hot Wheels DLC came out, I played it a ton, and then I beat it. So, I don't play it as much anymore. However, um, I'm thinking of recording some, some Forza Horizon 3 Hot Wheels uh, content because a uh, good, good friend, Roderick HD, actually asked for me to do that, and so I'm definitely considering it. So, so Roderick, I am definitely going to give that a shot. So we'll see how that turns out. And the very last question, which is two questions, so I guess we do have six, but it's in one comment, is from Brickwalt. Do you plan on doing any more IRL videos? Oh, yes. The, I, I plan on doing so many more. However, uh, I keep getting like these partial ideas of what I want to do and it's like really good. Like, I want to involve this and then later I'll have an idea like, I want to be doing this in the video. But it's really hard to design an entire video around these single ideas, so if you guys have any ideas for um, for skits that I could do, definitely let me know. But I love doing the IRL videos. I love like dressing up, getting into character, getting into a costume. Um, I was in a lot of uh, like plays and productions when I was a kid, and so I have okay acting skills, so I like to use those to just goof off and have fun. I'm definitely looking forward to doing a lot more live action stuff. Uh, I want to work on writing maybe a script for a short sort of film. I've done that before. It didn't turn out super good. Um, I actually have a really, really old YouTube channel. It has my very first decent, like half decent Lego animation and uh, some Blender animations in there. And it's so old, and they're actually still up on YouTube. So I'd I'd love to see you guys try to find that. That's uh, I'm not going to tell you any more, but it's Lego animations and Blender animations, and I believe there's only two or there. I think there's three videos on that channel. So good luck. The second question he asked is, and are you going to show your wife? Yes, yes I am. However, just not yet. Uh, I'm working on getting a good way to incorporate her into my channel. She doesn't really play a whole lot of video games, and that's really what anyone else that has been affiliated with the channel has done, and I'd like her to play some role instead of just stepping in, being like, hey everybody, and then walking out. I'd want her to be a bit of a bigger part in the video, so we'll see that, and I want it to be a surprise. I'm probably not even going to say that she's in the video until she is, and when she's been in a video, then maybe I'll have like a face reveal video or something. So you just keep your eye out. She may be in a video pretty soon. So who knows? So that is every single question for this video. I really hope you guys liked it. I definitely had fun making it and I love answering your guys' questions. I, it's one of my favorite things to do. If I could just sit and make a video about answering questions every single day, I would do that completely. So uh, feel free to have any more questions you uh, want answered. And every time I put out a new Q&A video, just ask your questions for the next one in the comment section of that video. So just check which one's the most recent. If this uh, in the future, in the distant future, is not the most recent, go and watch that, check out the comment section, and leave your comments there. So. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see all of you in the next one. Goodbye.